I saw the four beasts, one of an eagle, a lion, all those four were there. Then the 24 elders were singing, were saying, holy, holy, without stopping. The four beasts had bowels, like containers, having our prayer requests there, like scrolls, papers, bowing down, giving them to God. Hello, today I want to share with us the story of this 13-year-old boy who was cut up to heaven and came back with an evidence. I'm sharing this story because a lot of people are getting discouraged because they feel that their prayers are delayed and some others have come to the point of believing that God no longer cares about them. According to this boy, he was taken to the third heaven where he saw the 24 elders worshipping God and they were round about the throne worshipping God. He saw the prayers of the saints being offered before God. The prayers were in form of scrolls. Please watch this video. In fact, the end part of the video will shock you how this boy came back with the evidence of the encounter he had. So, it was my experience that I got. It was some time back when we were listening to a message while going home in the car. Then it was of a man who used to teleport in the spirit. So, he said he prayed a prayer before he used to do those things of teleporting the spirit. He prayed a prayer that he wanted to have an encounter with God. He said that if God did it for the whites, he can also do it for him because God is not a God of, of segregation. Yeah, actually that man is from India. So uh, he saw Dr. Bruce Allen talking about that, who is a white and American. So this Indian man also said he would do the same. That's 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 what he's referring to so i also made the same prayer i said if god did it for that indian man he can also do it for me so from then i kept on purposing that lord i want to have an encounter so it was on wednesday this week we had an overnight here and i said now i've got the good chance i'm not busy at school so i said this when overnight i have to purpose to have an encounter with god so we started praying there was apostle grace music in the background we prayed for many hours but i reached like at around 2 a.m there i felt like the spirit had taken over me then i went in a place i asked the holy spirit which place is this in the middle because that was a worship session going on in the background you are worshiping and praying yes. you had prayed for many hours yes it had taken long when you were engaging yes then something happened like you went in the spirit yes and you are moving to a place yes okay so then you did what you asked i asked the holy spirit which place is this then he told me this is the third heavens he told you you are now in the third heavens yes so when i reached there I saw the 24 elders like, I saw 24 people and I got a knowing those are the 24 elders, like a football pitch but which is little, but they were seated around like forming a circle around. Then I saw the four beasts, one of an eagle, a lion, all those four were there. Then the 24 elders were singing were saying holy, holy, without stopping. Then the four beasts had bowels, like containers, having our prayer requests there, like scrolls, papers, bowing down, giving them to God. That uh, you, 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 When you were telling me you demonstrated what they were doing, why, how were they giving them over to the one who was on the throne? Like... They were like... Yes. Then I had them say like you you are you are most 
Oh. Uh, like, okay, let me use you are worthy to open them. Like, oh, oh you are worthy to open this the, the prayer request to the yes. seal, like, yes. to know what is happening inside. Yes. Okay. Then from there. So, and, uh, yes, okay, continue. Then I bowed down and started singing also the song, Worthy is your name. But where are the. You, you, you don't move fast. So, you also found yourself bowing down and yes. singing the song, Worthy is your name. Yes. Okay. So. You, you said for you, you are singing, Worthy is your name, and then for them, they were singing, Holy. 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 Then, okay. where are the four beasts were giving the scrolls? I saw something very beautiful, I can't explain, but it was like crystal, stones, rock, but very beautiful, I can't explain what it was. Then covered with a lot of like lightings, a lot of light, I couldn't see what was there. So from there... And that's I, why they were bowing. Yes. Even, yes. From there, I bowed down and started singing the song. The Lord made me get... Like, he wanted me to understand. So, here's something that I could knew, I can know, but it wasn't the same in heaven. So, you smelled what? So, I smelled a perfume. You used the word aroma when you are telling me. Okay, an aroma of perfume, but it was very nice. Like, calm, very good. Okay, I can't explain how it was. But I saw that when the four beasts were bowing down, giving the scrolls to God. Then from there, I bowed down and started worshiping what is your name and got out. According to him, he saw the 24 elders in heaven. Let me read Revelation chapter 5 verse 8 says, And when he had taken the book, the four beasts, and the four and twenty elders fall down before the Lamb, having every one of them harps and golden vials full of others, which are the prayers of saints. Revelation chapter 8 verse 4 says, And the smoke of the incense which came with the prayers of the saints are set it up before God out of the angels' heads. God answers prayers. The shocking part of it is that this boy, 13 years old boy, he said he was shown the prayer points of one of them while they were praying. One of them, he wanted to actually know, okay, how do I know that our prayers have been answered? He was shown the prayer points and he wrote them down after he was shown. Then he told his pastor, and they called the brother and compared the two prayer points. They were 100% correct. Amazing. Praise God. God is amazing. God is alive. Keep trusting in God. God answers prayers. Just listen to him. You saw the prayer requests were like written in the form of a scroll. And where was the scroll? In the in the, in the? bowels. Something like bowels. And then at that point you smelled an aroma. Yeah. A sweet smell. Yes. But you and how did you know that these prayers were our prayers? That those that were in the prayer in the scrolls? Like I had a knowing. You had a knowing. Yes. That what they are presenting are our prayers. Yes. At that very moment. Yes. And so when he got out. He, he was still in the same experience in the spirit. He wanted to know what other people are praying about because he saw that they were being answered. And then he purposed to know about some people. Actually, he was distracted. He got out. But before he was distracted, then he, you said you wanted to know about what Joshua was praying for. Yes. So, okay. All the people who are around here. Yes. Because we had first watched a message and you told us if you want to know, you purpose and ask God. You told us about a scenario. Was it apostle? So, like, you had told him you have a prophecy for him, but maybe you had mistaken him. It as is not another. that apostle, it's the other apostle. So, yes. 
Then he came and then he said, Okay, it's fine, we can still get your pro- prophecy. So you prayed together and told God, What do you have for me about apostle? So then the prophecy came. So I also saw when the prayer requests were being answered in the other vision, kind of. So I said, God, what do you have for me about this one? Every person who was here. And I started from. Oh, so you started for your, on yourself or other people? From other people. On other people, yes. yes. I started from Joshua. Then the Lord showed me. Just so I do not want you to speak the details of the prayers, but yes, the Lord showed you. Lord showed me like a paper. Then I got a knowing that those were His prayer requests. I wrote them down in my book. So you you saw a paper me. and saw His prayer requests. Yes. Then you wrote them down in your book. Yes. Then he gave me also answers about all those prayer requests. He also gave you answers about the prayer requests. Yes. How God had answered and how yes. he had answered. Then. So uh, I, I got an opportunity when he told me this. Now he had not talked to Joshua. This is the first time he was saying this. So I said, now he wrote them down. He has them in his book. So he brought them. Now I called Joshua. I said, Joshua, do you know anything about this? There was a big shock there. So Joshua had also his book where he had written his prayer requests which he had come to pray for. And in that very moment, exactly what Joshua had written. And they are not common things. I also was surprised to see what Joshua had written. So not something that you will guess. And in their order, number one, this is what Jesse wrote. Number one, this is his prayer request. And God was saying, I've answered it. Number two, this number three, number four. And you said they were many, but then you summarized them, you got a knowing to summarize them in four yes. points. Yes. Ex- but on his sheet, there were, like, one point was broken down into, like, three. On his sheet, actually, his, every one point is broken down into three. Yes. But for you, God would give you a summary of that one point in one line. Yes. And you would be amazed if you can get those books and you look at what Jesse wrote, read, so, in heaven, and what Joshua had written, exactly 100%. As in, I mean 100%, that's what I'm saying. 100%. 100%. And then, of course, you saw other people, you may not have to mention their names, because you went and told them. If you're among those who are giving up on their God because of unanswered prayers or because the answers to the prayers are delayed, please don't give up. God revealed these, the prayer points, to this boy, this 13-year-old boy, just to confirm as evidence that, yes, I hear my children, I care about them. I am not deaf, I am not dumb. Please, let's hold on to our faith. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and comment. Until I come your way again, God bless you. Bye.